question eight hours fifty minutes minus six hours thirty five minutes so what we'll do we'll write hours and minutes and then here we will write 8 hour 50 minute and here 6 hours 35 minute and we will subtract. So this will be 5, this is 1 and this is 2. So this will be 2 hour 15 minutes. So our answer will be 2 hours 15 minutes. Hello students, let's get started with the subtraction of time. So last class we have already started with the addition. Now let's move on to subtraction. Today we will be doing exercise 11D directly and let's get started with question number 1E. So question number 1E is given that 25 hour 14 minute and 5 second minus 16 hour 24 minute and 10 second. So let's move on to the second group first. In second group, all of you can see that 5 second minus 10 second is not possible. So we will borrow 1 minute from minute group. 1 minute from the minute group. Or 1 minute can be said as a 60 second. Yes children? So we borrowed. 60 second from the minute group and this will be added with 5 second ok children so now the second group changes to 65 second 65 second minus 10 as we have taken 1 minute from the minute group so this 14 becomes 13 14 minus 1 becomes 13. 14 minus 1, 13. Okay, children. But here, as we know, 13 minus 24 is not possible. So, from here, we will borrow 1 hour. So, from here, we will borrow 1 hour. 1 hour or 60 minute. 60 minute and it will be added to the minute group so here 60 plus 13 so 60 plus 13 will be 73 73 and here we will form the minute group 73 minus 24 so, as we have taken 1 hour from the hour group, so 25 becomes 24. So, here in hour group, we will subtract 24 minus 16. Okay. So, now we will do the subtraction. 65 minus 10 is 55. 73 minus 24 that will be we can do the subtraction as we do 13 6 it is 6 7 8 9 9 4 49 minute and here 8 so our answer will be 8 hour 49 minute 55 second so students when the subtraction is not possible we have to borrow the numbers for, or the we have to borrow the time from our nearby group then we can solve the question now we will start question number one f the question is 14 hour 18 minute and 25 second minus 6 hour 30 minute and 48 second. So here also you can see that 25 minus 8 is not possible. So we will borrow 
वन मिनट और वी कैन से सिक्सटी सेकेंड फ्रॉम इट एंड इट विल बी एडेड टू ट्वेंटी फाइव ट्वेंटी फाइव प्लस सिक्सटी ओके चिल्ड्रेन सो एज वी हैव टेकन वन मिनट फ्रॉम दिस मिनट ग्रुप सो एटीन विल बिकम सेवेंटीन एटीन विल बिकम सेवेंटीन Okay, children. So let's first write down this second group. Twenty-five plus sixty. That is eighty-five. Eighty-five minus forty-eight. So here in the minute group, all of you can see that seventeen minus thirty is not possible. So we have to borrow. One hour from it, and we will be adding it into with six with sixty. So we will be bringing one hour, or we can say sixty minute. We will be borrowing sixty minute from it, and we will add it to the minute group. So seventeen plus sixty will be seventy seven. Minus thirty, and in the hour group, as we have taken one hour and given to the minute group, so fourteen will become thirteen. So here thirteen minus six is possible. So we will write it down directly. So we are ready now to do the subtraction. Eighty five minus forty eight. Eighty-five second minus forty-eight second will be how much, children? Yes, children. So we can do the subtraction over here. Fifteen, and this will become seven. So fifteen minus eight is seven. Seven minus four, three. So thirty-seven seconds. Now seventy-seven minus thirty. So it will be forty-seven minute. And thirteen minus six. Thirteen hour minus six will be seven. That is seven hour. So our answer is seven hour forty seven minute thirty seven seconds. Okay, children. Now let's get started with question number two B. So here we are going to solve about years and months. We are going to subtract seven year. Seven year. Eleven months minus three year eight months. Okay, children. So let's get started with the months. Months. What we have to do? In months, we are having eleven minus eight. Eleven minus eight is possible. So eleven minus eight is three. So here three months. Next is seven minus three. Seven minus three is four. So here is four years. So we got the answer as four years, and three months is the final answer. Okay, students. So now let's learn how to find out the time interval or the time gap. Between one time to the other time. So in exercise eleven D question number three A is given. What is the time interval between seven thirty a.m. and seven forty p.m.? So it is from the seven thirty a.m. morning to seven forty p.m. in the evening. So in this 
questions what we need to do is the first step we will subtract the timing in am from 12 hours so from 12 we will subtract 7:30 hours as we know in 24 hour clock the 12 is set as a noon time and the morning 7:30 is set as 7 hours 7:30 hours okay children and with that we will add this 7 40 hours 740 hours okay children so you need to remember that the am timing we have to subtract it from the 12 hours 12 hours minus the am timing so here i am doing the rough work 12 0 0 minus 7 hours 7 30 hours so as we know that from 0 30 cannot be subtracted so we will bring from 12 hours and we will give to 8 60 minute we will take 1 hour or 60 minute and we gave it to the minute group so this 12 will become 11 so 60 minus 30 is 30 11 minus 7 is 4 so here we got the answer as 4.30 hours. 4.30 hours. So here we can write it down as 4.30 hours plus 7.40 hours. 740 hours so we need to add now this 430 hours plus 740 hours okay we will see here how we will do the addition like the before class we learned how to do the addition here also we will do the addition in the same process okay children So you can see here I will be adding 4, 30 and 7, 40. So 0, 3 plus 4, 7. And 4 plus 7 is 11. Yes, so we got it. 11 hours 70 minute so this is the hour group this is the minute group so as we know this is more than 60 so we have to separate it we have to separate it 11 hours 70 minute and we have to separate this minute it will be 60 minute and 10 minute yes or no children yes so 60 minute is 1 hour so it will get added to it and 11 plus 1 will be 12 hours and the remaining here 10 will remain as a same 10 minute so our answer will be 12 hour 10 minute 12 hour 10 minute will be the final answer okay children i think you must have understood how to do the subtraction of time and time interval so please do 11 d exercise in your notebook with proper steps okay children thank you all of you